Hello champions and welcome back to more of the Unitard dies in Robocraft. Now I've switched accounts. I've gone back to the account that I started playing on uh, yesterday or well a while ago depending on when you watch this and when it gets uploaded. Um, but the first day that I got this game this was the account I made and then the next day I started my series. But I've decided to go back to the first account I made, mostly because this first vehicle I made, uh, I like it, and it works pretty good. And I noticed that the other vehicles I made, uh, just, they're not quite the same. They don't quite work as well. Uh, and I've unlocked a few things, and I I felt like after the three episodes that we did, um, that we would be in a position where I would have, you know, pretty much the same amount of stuff unlocked or be pretty close. And that wasn't the case at all. Uh, we had terrible luck and we kept dying. So I'll show you my tech tree. It's a little more unlocked than the last one, which we only had the enemy radar unlocked. So I now have for, t for tier one, I have the cubes unlocked. Uh, I have the front mount SMG, which is now tier two. I have the enemy radar, which is tier one. The hover blades, which were tier two. And the wheel steering, which is tier two. Now, this vehicle currently is tier one. Uh, because I don't have a lot of tier two stuff, I think I have a couple of tier two guns on it. Now, the reason why um, I want to play some tier one matches is I want to unlock everything that is Tier 1. You'll also notice that in our other game, the Radar Jammer was... Oh no, it was the Flipper that was Tier 1. Okay. So this was Tier 1 in our other game. So we can unlock that, and then we only have to play until, I believe... We get the Armored Prism, Armored Tetra, and the Armored Inner unlocked. And then we'll move on to Tier 2 and we'll continue to unlock Tier 2 stuff. Uh, I may not do this for every tier. I may not unlock everything for every tier. But at least for Tier 1, I want to unlock uh, all the Tier 1 things. And then we'll start more focusing on certain areas. Whether we want to go into Hover Blades, maybe ignore that and go into Wheels and then maybe get to Wings, uh, some Helium which will allow us to go up, rise higher, and then the wings will allow us to fly, I believe. Not quite sure how that works. Uh, all kinds of different paths you can take. It's pretty exciting. <laughs> Plasma launchers, rail cannons. Now, whatever type of weapon you go into, so if you use the SMGs, you can only have SMGs on your vehicle. If you go into rail cannons, you can only have rail cannons. If you go into... Plasma launchers. You can only have plasma launchers. You apparently, as far as I know at this point, cannot have a mix of rail cannons and plasma launchers. So it's better to focus on just one area. I haven't quite decided which area that's going to be. But shall we get into a match? Let's start playing. <laughs> Because uh, I have been not doing well. Bad luck, bad design in our other previous series matches. So hopefully today we can start winning again with the better vehicle, the Unitarded. So one of the things that's going on as we wait for this to load is I've noticed that there is a ton of people playing this game and the company itself is seeming to have a little bit of issues. The game is free to play, and it's recently gotten quite a bit of exposure from some of the more popular YouTube channels. And so it's no surprise that they're getting flooded right now with players. And so they've implemented a few things. They've done a server queue, which I was just in. It did take an enormously long period of time to get into play. Ooh, I don't know what's... Oh, that guy's a hover. Has he got a hover underneath of that? That's really weird. It took me a long time to get in. There was a thousand people in the queue. It was about 10-15 minutes. But they will resolve it once they upgrade their servers. 
And I'm okay with that, because it is free to play. There is no p pay to win. Uh, it's got a really good model. Everything that you can pay for, you can get for free in the game. So, I like that a lot. Oh, I, this is not good. Get out of here. Oh my goodness. Their entire team is right there. <laughs> pretty much, pretty much their entire team. Uh, I wasn't looking at the mini map, which I should have been. You know, this is just bad. There's no reason to stay here, because there's no way to win. So, let's get out of there. There's only me, really. So, if I go down the middle now, there's pretty much nobody there. It's a straight shot, and all my other guys uh, on my team are going to the base. So, we're going to do that as well. We're going to start camping, because uh, they haven't started yet. Though, they probably will get there soon. And we do still have a lot of guys at our own base to prevent them from being able to cap. So, we'll just get over here. We'll cap the base. I think we've got this match. Whoop. Okay, so currently we can't see anybody around us. So nobody's coming to this base, and they have only recently started capping ours. And, yeah, they don't got a chance. So already, our luck is changing. And this is what I mean. <laughs> this is why I wanted to switch. For some reason, that other account was totally cursed. So there you go, we got 14 tier 1 tokens, that should be more than enough for us to unlock all the tier 1 stuff that we want. I think it should be enough. And then we'll take off our old wheels, put on our tier 2 wheels, and we can go right into some tier 2 matches. But let's quickly take a look at this. And we'll unlock that. Unlock this, this one, and it's just down here with the flipper. There you go. And we still got five T1 points, but no more tier one unlocks. Right. So let's switch our wheels real quick, which will put us into tier two. So this is wheel without steering, so that will be on the back. And we'll come around here. And then our steering wheel. Now I could put on the hover, and I've had the hover on. The problem is I have hardly any stability, and what I've noticed is I float just high enough above all the barricades that I can still get hit. And so, I'm not sure I want to hover just yet until I have better weapons. Because currently, my weapons, I've only got a couple of tier 2 weapons. So, I, I think... I think we'll hold off on the hover for now. Okay. So we've got a couple of tier 1 guys on our team. Which does, doesn't necessarily mean we're at a disadvantage, but... It's hard to know until we start getting into battles. Now, why that happens is because they're in a group with someone who's Tier 2. And so that brings them into Tier 2. 
which is totally okay. So I seem to be completely on my own, so I've got to be very careful about what I face. Uh, there's also been an update today that... Oh no, oh no, oh no. Okay. So this guy is coming. I just want to get behind this rock outcropping here without flipping. Okay, that was good. And we'll turn around. And now when he's in my crosshairs, if I press Q, uh, I will target him. And I'm getting ruined! Oh my goodness, I'm getting ruined. Well, that didn't go as planned. <laughs> I did reach level 4, that's okay. Uh, they're gonna win, they've got an entire full team going on. So we will just exit out. Now the reason why sometimes I don't exit out is I do believe, though I'm not entirely sure, that you can only get tech tokens uh, if you stay and your team wins, that you don't get them if you leave. But since I'm pretty sure we're not gonna get any, it's okay. for us to leave. We'll set up another match right away. I'll hopefully get in there quick. Now there's something called ranked battles. I don't know what that is. I have not played long enough to know. But I'm not sure that's unlocked until tier 3 possibly and then maybe tier 3 you can start to enter those specifically when the time comes. But as of right now, there's no rankings or anything that we can see. So maybe we should stick with the group today? <laughs> I think so. I, it, it baffles me when I see a vehicle with wheels on it and hovers. It's very interesting. I guess the idea is that if your hovers get shot, when you hit the ground, you'll still be able to move. I don't know. We got one guy. We'll hide behind this guy. <laughs> I'm being hit, though. Okay, I need to get into a better position to shoot. <laughs> Go over here. Take out this guy, we'll get his guns off, hopefully. Okay, I am taking a lot of hits still. So maybe I should get out of the way. Oh no! <laughs> oh, terrible strategy by the Unitar. Oh my goodness. Oh, that's embarrassing. Well, for that, I don't even deserve tech points. So, <laughs> we're just gonna leave. Because even if my team wins, I don't deserve it. That that was just bad. Bad strategy. Bad technique. <laughs> Let's actually play for real now. <laughs> we got a win with our first match, and I got cocky, and now... Can't get a win to save my life. <laughs> I hope that that countdown doesn't mean I'm going to be in a ranked match. Well, this is interesting. This is the first time I've seen a team not have enough members. I've never seen that before. 
where a team is short two members. That's kind of weird. We had like four tier one players. Okay, so we're going to go off on our own. Try and get the cap. Okay. I was worried I was going to flip. We haven't done that yet. That's one thing that we haven't seen is a flip where you've taken no damage but you're upside down and completely like unable to move. There's one guy coming my way. There's two guys coming my way. There's actually three guys. Oh, there's the whole team! The whole team! <laughs> oh no! We just need to get out of here. <laughs> I don't know if we're gonna make it. We need to get to our team. We're not gonna make it. We're not gonna make it! <laughs> <laughs> ah! That's why you stick. Look at this guy. That guy's nuts. It's a pretty good little vehicle going on. Okay. Well, our team is winning. <laughs> this dude's flipped over. <laughs> so let's maybe check some other guys out. Since... Oh, I like that ship. That's pretty cool, actually. That's a very cool design. I kind of like that. We'll probably get into making one of those maybe in the next episode. We'll, we'll make a second vehicle that is a hovercraft. I think that's okay. We should have enough money that we can get some more guns. To get some, uh, we got two hover pads, I think. Or no, we we should have four. And that's pretty cool. So we did win, I believe. And we should get a couple of tier points for the win. Okay, or none. So we didn't get any. Um... Maybe my team lost. <laughs> I have no idea. I thought we won. It's possible we didn't win. Uh, I didn't get any tech points. So I'll have to look back and see. Because if even when my team wins, I still don't get tech points. Then it doesn't make sense to stick around and watch the match. Except for out of curiosity's sake. And maybe to check out some other vehicles. So this time, we're going to stick with the pack. 100%. Because apparently going on your own is a bad idea. <laughs> My roguish mentality is not working out for me. So there we go. Let's follow all these heavily armored dudes. And maybe that's something we should do now that we actually have them unlocked. I'm not sure if they cost any more P-flops. So if they don't, we could just replace all these crappy regular ones we have. With the better ones? Okay, let's try to flip you back. No, 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 I gotcha. There you go. <laughs> so he's got a flip back over thing in his vehicle. It's probably something we should add to ours as well. Got one unit. Oh. That. See? Why do you gotta do that? Huh? Greg Muse 84 300. Why do you gotta hit me and make me flip? Man, we're on the same team. Got some units down here, which I cannot see. 
Uh, they're already capping us. So you know what? I'm gonna go back to our base. And actually try to stop this cap from happening. I am not heading back to our base. So our base is this way. <laughs> How is it that we just... Oh no, that's their base. I'm so confused. <laughs> our base is this way. And I can't drive. Man, uh, we're gonna lose unless everybody heads back and prevents the cap. I don't even think I'm gonna make it back in time. Okay, so the cap has been prevented, but there is more guys going that way, so I'm gonna go back there as well. And help defend. Did that guy just go behind, like... Okay, now we're capping. So this guy's hiding up here, behind the mountains. I'm just gonna keep shooting at it, in case he pops out. But he pretty much has no chance. And now we're doing a good cap. There we go. That's interesting. I didn't know that there were spots you could hide. There we go. There we go. <laughs> well, we got a team victory. We didn't blow up the flyer. He was in no shape. Uh, and finally, I get some more tier 2 points. Only five, because apparently I did nothing. No assisted kills, no scouting, no base captures. Now, to scout, if you see something, a unit for the first time, and you press Q, you're supposed to be able to show it on the map. It's not working, though. I've tried it on a bunch of occasions, and I haven't been successful with it. So let's check out what we can unlock in Tier 2. That we might want. I think... Probably we want top mount SMGs. Uh, we can also get thrusters. I'm not sure we need that yet. And we can get better armor. Let me quickly look at this. So this is going to cost one P-flop. So we, we need to re-armor up our vehicle entirely. Uh, this also costs one P-flop. So we should maybe get this armor chassis which will give us armor of 136 this one gives us 86 oh that's way better and it is tier 2 which we're in currently so we could totally do that so 14 points for this 4 points for this so we can't do both but since we're going to armor up our vehicle right now, I think I'd rather unlock this. And be using those blocks. And then I can also get this one. For four points. In fact, I can get them all, so I'm just going to do that. I'm going to get all of them. <laughs> And completely armor up our vehicle with the Tier 2 armored cubes. I think that'll be good. Uh, I'm not going to make you watch, though. So I'm going to do that, and then when we get back, uh, this should be completely armored with, well, at least the top part. Um, yeah, it'll be different. Anyway, see you in a second. Alright, so I finally got all the blocks put on. Uh, we didn't quite have enough money to replace the entire robot yet, which is okay. That's kind of to be expected. Um, we are a lot more armored than we were, 
though the front is still pretty vulnerable because uh, I bought just the blocks instead of these pieces that I need to fit the front the way I want it to look. Uh, so, yeah, we're going to have to play a bunch more matches, which we're going to do anyway. And then with that money, we can buy more blocks and eventually we'll have a completely green robotic vehicle. Okay, let's play one more match and then... I think we'll call it an episode. <laughs> I definitely want to test this out, though. I want to see how much of a difference it makes being more armored. Now, our weapons have no more armor. They're exactly the same. Okay, cool. Let's follow these dudes. Oh, I like the hovercrafts. I do like them. If I can figure out a way to keep it stable, uh, I'm definitely going to make one. Though I won't be making one now in the next episode because we have no money. <laughs> but soon, soon we will. Now it's possible I'll still play today. Without recording, uh, I will not unlock any of the tiers, though. I think I'll keep everything the same, but I may make a hovercraft uh, and also refit this with more armor without recording. But I do want to keep playing. This is not a good spot for us. turn sideways, we should be more armored than we were. <laughs> well, still not armored enough to take heavy fire from a single vehicle. He got to my dude, and my dude went bye-bye. <laughs> well, on that note, <laughs> I am terrible at this game. <laughs> we will try to get better. I will see you all next time. Thanks for joining me.